For the first time in Summit's 10-year history, the Spartans football team are state champions. Summit takes the Class 5A title 28-7 over Oak Ridge. Mr. Football finalist Destin Wade had a hand in the first three touchdowns, rushing for two scores and throwing for another, while the Spartans' defense bottled up the Wildcats all night. You know, it's just an unreal feeling still, uh, just still uh, taking it all in, and I just give all the glory to God. Oh, it's amazing. This feeling, it, it, you, it like can't get much better than this. Just coming out with the mentality we had and just winning, and my last year as a senior it was just amazing. It feels good. It's not quite sunk in yet. I mean, it's, it's hard to exhale, but uh, it's exciting. Happy for the guys, happy for the community. Uh, they deserve it. They work their tails off. Summit held Oak Ridge to just 24 yards rushing on 21 attempts and outgained the Wildcats 304 to 145 on the night. It's really unexplainable, man. I feel like it's going to feel even more powerful when I get home and I, it really sets in. Uh, I was going to be happier. This is what we worked for. We've gone through so much adversity, whether it be COVID or whether it be somebody being hurt or losing Keaton, uh, but we've just prevailed. We've worked really hard. We've had great leaders, and it's just, it's just been great. King finished with 66 yards on the ground and added three catches for 33 more. This one went for 19 yards in the second. Another big-time producer Friday was Brady Pierce. The Dewall Jr. rushed for 30 yards and snagged three passes for 88 more, including this 13-yard strike in the second. His fourth-quarter pick six sealed the win. He's an old-school football player. I mean, he is, he is not flashy-looking, but he is a hard-nosed football player. The quarterback of our defense, Coach Melton, loves him. He's a safety. He gets everybody right positions and uh, just become a playmaker for us on offense. Destin needed some, uh, some, some targets to hit, and, and, and Brady was catching everything and, and running the ball hard and, and ended up being our big play guy. And him and Jolly about the only two that played both ways. I know Destin did a lot tonight, but uh, very few of them played both ways, and just, just he's a player, man. He's just old school. Pierce also had four punts with one stranding the Wildcats at their own three-yard line. Oak Ridge's lone score came late in the second when Mitchell Gibbons hit Brandon Hayward with his two-yard pass. Coach Coleman said his team learned from last year's runner-up finish. And I just think being here last year was, was huge. It was big to come into this game, and they were settled. They were eager all week. They weren't satisfied last week with the win. So, uh, you know, you can kind of feel it. 